I gave you the largest tax cut and reforms in American history, and we will cut taxes further, and we're cutting taxes for the middle class. We're cutting taxes for people that need jobs, and nobody's ever done it at a level like we've done it. By contrast, Sleepy Joe Biden will give you the single biggest tax hike in the history of our country. He's talking about quadrupling taxes, four trillion in taxes so he can waste it on the Green New Deal. The Green New Deal. No cars, no airplanes, no cows, no cows, you know. Whatever happened? Did they ever leave the cows in? I think they had to take that out, right? Remember? Originally, it was no cows. They didn't want to have any cattle or cows, which is pretty brutal when you think of it, right? He'll bury you in regulations, dismantle your police departments, dissolve our borders, confiscate your guns, terminate religious liberty, destroy your suburbs. You know, I'm always saying, I'll tell you, the fraudulent media, so I always get up and I have fun. Please, please, suburban women, you should love me. I ended the regulation that's going to destroy the suburbs. Please, please. Suburban women, you should love me. You know, because somebody said I'm not doing that well with suburban women. I said, why? I, you know, last time I was supposed to be doing terribly with women. Then I got 52%. They said, what the hell happened with Trump and women all of a sudden? Remember, they said Trump did well with women. So, now they go. They, so I kid, I kid. I say, please, please, suburban women, please, please love me, suburban women. I want you to love me. Because I got rid of the regulation that's going to destroy your neighborhood. You don't want to have projects next to your house. You don't want to have crime in the suburbs, etc. right? So I go on 60 Minutes, and she says, Leslie Stahl, that's another beauty. She goes, she goes, you were begging. You were begging suburban women to love you, weren't you? I said, no, no, I was just having fun. We were just having fun. These people are sick. They are bad. They are bad. But they want to decimate Florida seniors, and seniors, all seniors, OK? And by the way, what I've done for suburban women, but suburban people, people that live in the suburbs, you know, that's, the, that's really the dream. That's the American dream. And you know, 30% of the people, because people say, oh, is that racist? 30% of the people living in the suburbs are minority groups, Hispanic American, Black American. Think of it. Asian American, 30, 31 percent are from minority groups. For years, Joe Biden fought to cut your Social Security. He wanted, he wanted to cut it. He wanted to knock it out. And Medicare, a fact which Joe is now falsely denied. You notice? Oh, I loved it yesterday, the way he denied that. So does that mean you want to get rid of fossil fuel, Joe? Oh, uh, yes, that's what it means. Oh, thank you. This debate, let's end it. Let's end it right now. By the way, I got treated very, I thought, very fairly by the anchor. I thought, right? Kristen, I was surprised. She's been a little bit rough on me over the years. I was surprised. But her, you know, network has been crazy. NBC, Concast, C-O-N, Concast. But I thought Kristen did a very good job yesterday. Some people said she interrupted me much more than she interrupted Sleepy Joe. But that's because he didn't have that much to say, so. But no, I thought she was fair. I said it during the show. I said, I think you've handled it very professionally. It's not easy. So today, I want to show you Joe Biden's own words. The video I'm about to play was created by Bernie Sanders, Crazy Bernie. You know, Bernie's the single great.